In this video, I'm going to show you a really cool drill that you can start implementing into your practices right now. The name of the drill is moving around the horn. So just like when you would do throwing around the horn through the bases, it's the same thing, but you're actually moving and following the ball where it's being thrown. Skill level is intermediate. Again, this is a great drill to start warming them up, getting the blood flowing, helping you work on accurate throws, again, communicating, making sure they're calling the plays, and at the same time, learning how to throw on the run. So this is how you do uh, moving around the horn. So just like when you do regular around the horn, so you have players stationed at each base, right? And then you basically throw the ball to one, one takes it, throws to two, two throws it to three, three then throws it to home, Next person comes in, and then they keep throwing it around the horn. So the differences between that drill, okay, and doing it, moving around the horn, you're actually following the ball. Okay, so here's our players. So let's use a different color. So now, when the person at home plate throws the ball to first, okay, this person is actually now following that ball. So let's actually changes to a different color. So let's say green. So they're actually now coming following the ball. So after they receive it, first baseman is actually going to throw a grounder to them. That person who now is following the ball is going to take that grounder, receive it, and then they're going to throw it over to two. Okay. So now that person who threw that ball back or received that one is now going to follow that ball. It's going to come this way. That person who received it is now going to throw a grounder back to this person here. They're going to take that ball they're going to fill that grounder, and they're going to throw it to three. Three is going to take it, okay? And then that person on three is going to take that. So that person who received the ball, the two who just threw it back, that person who came from one, is going to now follow that ball. That person over here is now going to throw that grounder over to the person there. They're going to feel that grounder, and they're going to throw it to home, to four, okay? So that person is going to get it. The person who received it there is now going to kind of follow that ball, and they're going to basically come in, and that person who took it there is going to throw a grounder back to them. They're going to receive the ball and going to throw it back to one. That person, again, who took it there is going to start all over. This person is going to come in, and they're going to take that ball, throw it to two, and so forth, and keep going. Okay? So, again, the great part about this, it warms them up. Okay? So they're actually running. Um, and when you really want to get into the details and sort of the, the heart of the actual drill, you can start teaching them how to throw on the run, right? So when that person's actually coming down and receiving that grounder, they're going to have to feel that ball, and then they're going to actually have to step and then throw to the base, right? So it's like if a, a grounder was hit into here, shortstop's charging the ball, they're actually going to take that ball on the run and throw it over to one, right? So different plays again, but, I mean, when you first start this off, what you want to start doing is just all you want them to do is simple and you'll see sometimes they'll just not pick it up right away. It just takes time, and they get used to it. But just start by throwing it around the horn first, and then demonstrate by actually like, hey, follow the ball. So when you get to follow, follow the ball, that person who receives on the bag is going to immediately throw a grounder back to that person. That person is going to throw it to the base in front of where they received it, and then keep going. That person is going to receive that ball, throw a grounder back to that person who threw it, and then throw it to the base in front of that person. Right, And then when you start doing that, then you can start introducing them grounding, taking that grounder and then throwing on the run, which is on the side, right? And then off balance throw to the actual base. So they start working on those types of actual skills. So again, this is a great drill to start doing uh, first around the horn and then moving around the horn, following the ball and then introducing throwing on the run and then accurate throws to the base. Okay, so again, great drill. Great to start warping up, pumping up the blood, and then working on some of these skills that they'll be using in the game. Thanks for watching Easy Softball Drills for your practice plan. And make sure to check out our other videos.